Hey there, I built an effects loop switcher and I just wanted to show it off here. There are four loops indicated by the top row of LEDs. Got a tube screamer, an octave pedal, fuzzing gate, and a delay in the loops. And I've got a number of presets, which I'll run through quick. So the first leftmost preset, nothing is engaged. It's just guitar rig that I'm running at the moment. Second loop, we have the octave and the flashback engaged. Uh, let's see if I can... Oh, yeah. Just make something ethereal. Next loop, just Tube Screamer in there. Just a nice light drive. The rightmost preset, I have the octave and a fuzz in there. And then I've got access to three more presets by doing double presses. So press these two at the same time. And I just have an octave pedal in there. And double press those. I've got Tube Screamer and the Fuzz, so all the gain that you could ever ask for. And double press these ones. And uh, it seems like everything's in the loop, which is just chaos. Um, And if you want to program any one of these, so hey, this one's blank, I actually say I just want a delay on there. Press and hold, starts flashing, boom, I got a delay. And I save it by pressing and holding again, flashes, I can go up. Say, oh, actually, let's say from a crunchy. And the other thing that I built into uh, this unit is some MIDI control, so I have it plugged into uh, a MIDI interface, and I'm currently on MIDI channel 1, so if I set it to MIDI channel 1 in Guitar Rig, which is set just here, channel 1. Now on the pedal, if I press um, channel 1, so say I press the leftmost one, I actually switched presets on Guitar Rig to channel 1, channel 2, channel 3, channel 4, channel 5, etc. Pretty cool, eh?